Pre di Aguila, silang ka sa mundong ito. Happy, happy one day mga Bex! At syempre mga Bex, dahil yan sa inyo, maraming maraming salamat sa lahat na nag-subscribe at sa lahat ng bagong subscriber. Welcome sa pamilya ng kabaklaan! Hello! Welcome, welcome! Maraming maraming salamat! Sa pagbibisita sa ating channel, maraming maraming salamat. Iba, iba yung level ng happiness ko ngayon at pati yung energy ko ngayon, iba! Iba ngayon. Mm. And syempre mga Bex, ang ating pag-giveaway will be in this video. I will be announcing ang ating mechanics. Kaya stay tuned. Malay nyo, nasa gitna, nasa unahan, nasa huli. Hindi natin alam dahil yung iba sa inyo dumidiretso sa mechanics. Kaya panoorin nyo muna tong video na to. <laughs> Anyways mga Bex, in this video we are going to talk about Kim Kardashian West new KKW Glam Beauty. So mga Bex, Kim Kardashian released her KKW Glam Bible Bundle which is retail for $150 that will allow you to recreate her sultry and neutral look. Yes! Pag ito ang binili nyo, kikim Kardashian kayo. Kikim Kardashian kayo, ito yung mukha nyo. Yes mga Bex, in this video we are going to do a demo, review, and first impression for KKW Beauty's new collection which is the Glam Bible Bundle. And I am just so excited for this video mga Bex kasi this is my first KKW Beauty. I figured I wanna try it and since they have their new collection which is this very cute and very Kim K na collection, I figured to buy it kasi Medyo promising yung nasa loob. Pero, totoo ba? Totoo bang maganda? Ano bang binibili natin? Yung product o yung pangalan? Kaya naman ang this video mga Bex, we are going to do a first impression, review, demo for this new collection na Glam Bible Bundle from KKW Beauty. Kaya naman, tama na mga chika-chika. Let's go ahead at mag-penke na tayo. Oh my God! Pa! Kuntur agad. <laughs> so, ito na nga ang ating Glam Bible para sa kagandahan. Para ma-achieve ang ganda ni Kim K, ito gumawa siya ng Glam Bible. And pakikita ko sa inyo kung ano yung nasa loob nito. But, I just wanna say that nagdagdag na rin ako ng products na binili. Binili ko tong contour nila. Contour cream ni Kim Kardashian. And also the powder contour niya. So, this one, I really like it because it's very creamy. And tingnan nyo naman, humulma. And this one, mamaya itatry ko yan. I just want you guys to know that in this collection, it is not a full package. Meaning, wala siyang foundation, concealer, and pang contour. So, let us now open this bad boy. So the packaging is really very, wow, very Kim Kardashian. It is a nude, um, I think nude pink ba to? This is not a nude pink, right? This is kind of like a nude brown. And then nilagay rin niya dito yung kanyang brand, which is the KK Beauty. And then sa side niya nakalagay rin is KK Beauty. Now the packaging is very sturdy. This is not a plastic. Default shot. Okay, so let's now open this KKW Beauty. Okay, so like what I said earlier, wala, wala yung concealer and contour niya dito sa collection na to. On my right side, dito sa right side niya, it's all about the eye products. And then on the left side, it's all about face products. Okay, so this collection contains four eye makeups, which is eyeshadow, eyeliner, and then meron siyang lashes, which is medyo parang hiko to bet. And then, meron din siya dito. Um, this is their mascara. Now, on the left side, meron naman siyang two lipsticks, one lip gloss, and then meron siyang lip liner, and then some blush, 
and highlighter. I really, really love this packaging kasi alam mo yun, yung parang may lalagyan ka na ng makeup. Kasi feeling ko, protektado ang inyong mga sandata. Kasi tinan nyo, napaka-organized na niya and contour foundation na lang nga ang dadalhin mo kasi andito na siya sa lahat. Okay, so now let's make a look. Okay, so zinum ko lang kayo para makita talaga natin ang performance ng eyeshadow na to. So now let's start with the eyeshadow. So this one is a six pen eyeshadow palette. And then kapag binuksan mo siya, meron siyang mirror. Ganito yung mirror niya. And then, yung shades niya is nasa likod. Okay, to, so tingnan natin yung swatches nito. Ito pwede tayo mag-swatch kasi six lang naman siya. So this palette contains six shades. Meron tong four mattes, one shimmer, and then meron siyang one cream matte. So the creamy matte is the femme. And then this um, measure rosy is the rescue, which is a matte. And then the shimmer one is a fatal. This is their metallic silver. And then ito naman na matte gray is the antique. Now itong um, warm brown is the exotic. And this matte na black is the dark. Then ito yung mga shades niya. Wow, sumaswatch na ako. <laughs> okay, so this one is retail for $30. And feeling ko siya yung pinaka-pricey sa collection na to. And medyo hindi ako masaya kasi six shades lang siya. Okay, so ito mga bags ha. Kakaswatch ko lang. And medyo ma-fallout siya. So, kabado ako dito, dai. The color of choices is actually parang feeling ko kulang for me mga bags pero kung gusto niyo ng mga parang ganitong neutral and yung kaya niyo magpa-sweet this is actually okay. Kaya niyo tong gamitin for a day or kahit sa gabi. Pwede niyo siyang gamitin. Pag gusto niyo magpa-sweet, pwede kayong magpunta dito sa shade na to, parang rosy gemme na color. Kapag gusto niyo gumabi naman, Pwede kayong mag-shimmer eme. Pero nga, dahil sobrang konti ng choices ng shades, eh, kung ayaw mo nang paulit-ulit, hindi to para sa'yo. But kung gusto mo nang paulit-ulit, carry lang sa'yo yun. You don't have a problem with that. Then, para to sa'yo. Okay, so since this is only six shades, medyo challenging siya sa akin. Pero, dahil nga may black siya, I figured mag i smoky eye tayo. I wanna know, I wanna see kung gano'ng ka-intense yung black niya. Kaya, magbablock is smoky eye tayo ngayon para malaman natin kung gaano kabongga ang black the color na ito. Okay, so for my transition, I'm gonna use this Rescue. Rescue ba yun? Parang Rescue. I-Rescue mo ako! <laughs> and with my Morphe X Jeffree Star JS5 na crease brush, I'm gonna put this on my crease. I'm gonna make this as my transition. Kinda like the pigment of this. It's buildable. So, para nag smoky eye kayo mga Bex, kailangan talaga nagka-transition kayo. Ito ang pinaka-importante sa smoky eye. So, I'm going to get this exotic. And then, I'm gonna start um, building a shape sa aking crease. And then, I'm gonna go back with the residue. And then, babalikan natin yung mga edges na ating pinag blend in fairness, both of them are very buildable. Maganda siya i-blend. It's not even chunky. Okay, so now I'm gonna go with this dark. And then we're just gonna pack this on our lower crease. We're gonna start from the outer corner, okay? This is very pigmented. Ooh! Should be fine. We're just gonna pack it. Don't be scared. Are you scared? Mama scared? Remember, don't put it too high. We're gonna put it lower. Okay, sa baba. Uso ngayon ang panda. <laughs> Pausuhin natin. <laughs> Now, kukuha ko ng maliit na brush, which is this is Morphe's M506. And then, even blend ko yung edges niya. Okay, so now I'm going to change my brush, which is a flat brush. And then, I'm gonna go back with the black one that we just put. Then, ipapack yan sa aking lead. 
Because what I normally do is I put a gel liner in a black and then I'm gonna put that on my leads and then I'm gonna set it with a black eyeshadow. But this one, I wanna try kung gaano kaganda ang pigment na to. Dahil $30 daw siya. Oh, yeah, very kinky. Very kinky. Vet ko to. Ang ganda ng pagkaitim niya. Vet, vet, vet ko to. Isha yung ano, yung chunky and then very smooth siyang nag-glide sa aking lids. Kahit may fallout siya sa pan, but when you apply it actually, it stick right away. Hindi siya nag, tinan nyo, wala naman nagpo-fall out. In fairness, ang formula. Kabog. Now we're just gonna blend these edges. So now I'm gonna go with this Rizzy Q. I'm gonna go with my upper crease. And then, dadaan daan ng kulang siya, babalik balik ang kulang siya, just to soften the edges. Okay, so now since our eyeshadow is too dark, kailangan lahat dark. So kailangan walang skin na natitira. At dahil jam pupunta tayo sa eyeliner. So this is their eyeliner, which is sa shade na black. Hello, yun lang yung nakalagay dito. This is an eyeliner black one. Parang ang light niya. So, this eyeliner is retail for $10. Okay, so now we're gonna... Oh my goodness. I just dropped my vape. Is that my vape? Okay, so now, tatry ko siyang lagyan sa ating eyelids. Kung gaano ka-creamy ito. Now, we're gonna do is, we're gonna do a tight line. Ito yung nilatapakot ako eh. Naiiyak ako lagi nito. <laughs> May eyeliner na hindi masyadong kumakapit and kailangan balik-balikan mo pa. Eh, ang gusto ko isang balik lang. This one, kailangan balik-balikan ko siya. Okay, try naman natin sa baba sa ating waterline. Ayan o, oh, yung hindi siya intense. Hmm? Ano pa naman ako dito? Excited pa naman ako. Sabi na eh, swatch pa lang eh. Mga ganito kasi, ito yung maayo ko, yung parang hindi siya ganun ka-pigment kapag nilagay mo na sa waterline mo. Kasi mamaya, nawawala na yan. Oh, hindi ba kasi basa na yung... Oh, I don't like things. Ayan no, yung kapag basa na yung waterline mo, ang hirap na niyang ano yan. Tara! Mas pigmented pa ata yung eyeshadow. Mag-eyeshadow na lang tayo. Okay, so now I'm gonna go back with the dark shadow and I'm gonna put this on my waterline. Buti pa yung eyeshadow. Bongga to. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. This one. Ano siya na yun? Ten dollars din yun. Okay, so now I'm gonna go with the Rusty Q. Okay, so now babalikan ko lang ulit yung black na nilagay ko sa waterline. Okay, so I'm pretty much done with my eye makeup. Now, let's go with our lashes. Okay, so now let's go ahead with the Glam Bible Mascara. Not sure if this is really a waterproof. This is the wand. Yung wand niya, parang patulungan niya na itaas yung lashes ko ng mabilis. Kaso hindi siya ganun kabongga. Like, I have to go back. Para mag coat And so I kinda like it kasi hindi siya chunky and medyo na pre-prevent niya yung lashes ko mag go down. Get down. And ito, this one it makes it thicker yung aking lower lash, I mean lower lashes. Okay, so nakalimutan ko mga bags. This mascara is retail for $18. Okay, so now let's go ahead with their lashes. Paveve siya. I'm not living for this because it's too light. I mean, if you are into light lashes, this could be for you. But me, I'm not really a fan of this kind of lashes. Like so brang beef. But there's a but. You guys could use this for like a natural look. So so brang nipis niya mga bags. Okay, so ginupit ko siya and. Kasi masyado siyang mahaba. Maganda naman siya sa lashes ko. Kaso yung puti-puti niya, nakikita niyo yung parang silver lining. <laughs> Hindi ko bet yung ganyan. Okay, so lalagyan ko siya ng mascara para i-blend natin yung ating real lashes. Sa so, 
Okay, so since parang meron siyang um, puti-puti na ganyan, I'm gonna put some liner. I'm using a Pat McGrath eyeliner. Okay, so I kind of like how it's blending on my um, real lashes. Kaso, the only thing that I don't like about this is yung may puti siya and... That's not cute. Okay, so dadaanan ulit natin yung contour natin using this KKW powder contour niya. Ito yung single contour. Okay, so now let's go with their blush. This is in a shade Lux. This is a matte neutral peach. I'm, I'm into peach right now. Okay, so this is a very nice packaging. Meron siya mirror dito and glass na parang nilagyan nila ng color sa loob. It's plastic, by the way. I'm kind of living for the package of this because like, ugh. So I can talk to you right now. I'm doing my blush. No, my blush right now is pretty much intense. I like this. I really like this. It's matte and then it's just give you that peach matte. It's very buildable. Okay, so this blush is retail for $18. Okay, my back. So now let's go ahead with Glam Bible's highlighter, which is Glitz and Glam. So this is a paralyzed peach um, champagne. I'm living. We're going to try this na dry pa yung ating brush. Just to see kung paano yung pigment niya. So kahit dry yung brush mo, the pigment is really good. Nalagyan lang ako sa aking inner corner. Okay, so now I'm gonna try to actually wet my brush and see kung mas bongga rin siya kapag basa yung brush mo. The pigment is really good. Okay, so now let's go with their lip liner in the shade Classic Liner. This is the color Neutral Mauve. One of the claim of this is this is creamy, so I'm kind of excited because I like creamy lipsticks now. Because my lips is always dry and and kapag nagmata ko, hindi siya maganda sa aking lips. Mmm, it's very creamy. Pwedeng kahit ito lang, pwede niya na tong gawing lipstick. Mmm. Okay, my bags. This liner is retail for twelve dollars. So now let's go with their lipsticks. This lipstick is retail for eighteen dollars. Isa. So eighteen dollars is ato. Tanda ng pagkakemi nito. Tinan yun para sa may mga drip ng water. Okay, so my bags. This comes with two shades, and one of them is the classic icon one. This is a warm mid tone nude. And then this one naman is the Classic Icon 2. So I kind of want to go with this Classic Icon 2. Now warm the pink tone and nude. I like this. This is very creamy and niche sticky. And also, and the linyang ilagay. One coat is enough, but since I'm extra. Ooh, I'm feeling the fantasy. I'm feeling Kardashian's fantasy right now. Okay, so now let's go ahead with their gloss. This is in the shade Lust. This is a sheer pale peach. Okay, so now I'm just going to do my setting spray. And alam nyo na kung ano nangyayari sa channel ko. That ang setting spray is ko merong potion. Dahil sa tuwing spray ko, nag-iiba ang itsura ko. <laughs> Ayan mga Bex, Ayan, nagustuhan nyo ba ang ating kumikim K na look? Ayan, so may pag gray na hair tayo and I kinda like saw this on her look na meron siyang gray hair and then she is a dripping in diamonds. That's why I figure out we are gonna drip in um, tanso. Medyo naka-jubad tayo. <laughs> Anyways, mga Bex, andito na tayo sa level ng final thought. Ang hindi ko lang naman bet is this eyeshadow pan and the eyeliner and the lashes. 
But the rest is really good, mga Bex. I love all of this. And don't get me wrong with the eyeshadow. It's a very good formula. And if you guys like those kind of eyeshadows, and the napaka lit la, and you guys could always put it on your purse or bag, this is actually for you. Pero uh, the reason um, I did not like this pan is napaka konti lang ng selection niya. Yun lang naman yung problema ko, but the formula is really good, though it's really expensive. Also, mga Bex, inad ko lahat ng nasa loob na to, and they are for $162. Kasi based dito sa ano ko, eyeshadow is $30, liner is $10, and then the mascara is $18, yung blush nila is $18, yung highlighter nila is $20, and then yung lip liner nila is $12, tapos yung cream lipsticks nila Tig isa is eighteen dollars, so dalawang eighteen dollars. Yung lip gloss nila is eighteen dollars. So overall, it's a hundred and sixty-two dollars. Pero kapag ito ang binili mo, it's only for a hundred and fifty dollars. May libre ka pang lashes. Kaya naman ang KKW Glam Bible Collection is Betty Five. There you go, mga Bex. I hope you guys like this video, and sana na gusto hanyo ang ating para review sa ating KKW Beauty. Pati na rin ang ating look. <laughs> and sana nabigyan ko kayo ng konting tips and tricks pagdating sa pag the black smoky eye. And when it comes naman sa ating products, sana nag-enjoy kayo. Nabigyan ko kayo ng actually konting thoughts about this product. Kasi if you guys are going to check out KKW Beauty, um, makikita nyo na agad yung Glam Bible. Kasi ito yung pinakabagong-bago niyang collection. And of course, siyempre, bago nyo i-purchase, we would like to know what is really inside and ano ba talaga ang meron sa Glam Bible na para hindi rin naman masayang ang mga pera nyo. Gano'n ah! Pero siyempre, mga Bex, dahil tapos na ang ating pakeme, i-a-announce ko na ang ating mechanics ng ating pag-giveaway. Okay, so first of all, mga Bex, I just want you guys to know that we are going to have two kinds of challenges sa aking pinakamalaki ata to sa aking giveaway na ginawa. Magpapa Jeffree Star ako. But, syempre mga Bex, meron akong dalawang klase ng challenges, okay? So, gagayahin natin ang, ang RuPaul's Drag Race, which is meron siyang mini challenge and the maxi challenge. Jacket lang ako. Malamig na! Kanina ko pa tinitiis. <laughs> For the main, for the mini challenge, ngayon natin siya gagawin. And ang isa sa aking pamini challenge ay magpapahula ako kung ano ang nasa loob ng box na to. So, ang gagawin nyo lang is huhulaan nyo kung ano ang nasa box na to. Kung sinong pinakaulang nakasagot kung ano ang nasa loob nito ay mananalo ng Morphe X, Jeffree Star, Trio Sponges. And, meron na kayong Trio eyeshadow pan from Morphe, and then magkakaroon niya kayo ng lip kits, which is a lip liner and a lipstick from Morphe as well. Kaya ang clue na gamit mo to, yun lang ang clue ko for now. Isayat sa inyong gagawin. Then subscribe to my YouTube channel, follow me on my Instagram, and on my Facebook page and on my Twitter, which is John Fidelyaga. Pag nilagay niyo yung answers sa comment section, I want you guys to put sa ako kayo pwede makontak para mabigay ko sa inyo ang ati premio. And then on my next video, I will be announcing kung ano ang nasa loob ng box na ito. And also, I will be announcing kung sino ang nanalo. Siya ang makakareceive ng prize for our mini challenge. Anyways, mga Bex, syempre, hindi natin makakalimutan ang comment of the day! Comment of the day! Comment of the day! Comment of the day! Eh! Eh! Comment of the day! At eto na sila! Thank you, thank you so much. And sa lahat ng laging nandito sa aking channel and lagi kayo nandiyan para sumuporta sa akin, maraming maraming salamat. Di ko makukuha ang 1K kung wala kayo and hindi kayo nag-recommend ng mga tao para manood sa atin. Maraming maraming salamat. Oh my gosh. Up until now, I'm still happy. And lalo ako na eager gumawa ng magagandang videos para sa inyo mga Bex. And my next video will be kaabang-abang. Aya abangan si Bakla. Anyways, mga Bex, tatapusin na natin ang video na to. But 
If you guys like this video, don't forget to give me a thumbs up. And if you guys are new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe. Para naman sa mga bags natin dyan na laging gustong update it, hit that notification bell button right there. Para sa tuwing upload ko, you guys are always updated. And once again, thank you so much and see you on my next video. Bye!